This is the Schmo with the Pro. He's 12 and 3. He's formerly Megatron. He's now known as No Hype. Phil Hawes in the flesh. ADCC Las Vegas, Nevada. How we doing? Always good. Always good. Always a pleasure here at ADCC. Uh, loving the people. Loving the events. Crazy. We hiding the blonde hair or is it back to normal? Right now, I'm normal. I'm back to normal. Just fill up right now. No hype. Just fill. No hype. The Schmo was at the last fight. You won in dominant fashion against the Ron Wynn, who was over there at a fight night in Austin, Texas. The next one is October 29th against Roman Dolidiz. Yep. Dolidiz? Dol Dolidiz? Just some guy. Just some guy. Just some guy to me. He's a powerful guy. He's a powerful guy. He's a powerful guy. He won in the same fight card as you in Austin, Texas. He did. He did. He was on my undercard. He was. Yeah. Dolidiz. Yeah. Dolidiz. Dolidiz. He's tough. He's going to be a tough fight. Uh, it's going to be a dog fight, but um, I'm a bigger dog, so you know how it is. I'm going to get the win. A lot of noise from the post fight between you and DC, man. Some miscommunication, but DC's your guy, yeah? He's, he, he's one of them. He's a good guy, one of the good guys. Uh, a little hyped. Um, I think he was picking sides, of course. De uh, Durant's his boy. Trains with him, yeah? Yeah, trains with him, but I mean, fighting for me is personal, so if you pick his side, then it's war. If the Schmo looked inside the gym at Kill Cliff FC, it's the new name, by the way, a lot of top middleweights, a lot of guys coming to the South Florida to train there, man. Who are you training with these days? Because a lot of guys come there. Man, we got Derek Brunson. We got Brandon Allen. We got Gregory, who won last night. Killer performance. Look at that stitches, man. Yeah. Man, yeah. Robocop. It was worth it, though. 50K, extra 50K for it. Uh, man, we got so many good guys. It's crazy. Yeah. You got Michael Chandler. He's back in the gym, right? Because he's got Dustin Poirier. Yeah, he's got Dustin. That's a little, little guy. Uh, yeah, he's out there. Uh, he's training. Good. He's like uh, the captain of the team. Dorino as well. You know, he's helping him train a lot for Dustin Poirier. Is Dorino going to be fighting Moss at all? We keep hearing that, but nothing's being booked yet. I don't think Moss at all wants that smoke. I don't think. I think it's a smart decision. Uh, he knows Dorino's a beast, a different animal. What he's bad at, Dorino has. So that's, that's smart on his part. What's it going to take to get you inside the top 15 in the middleweight division? Just more more body counts, I guess. You know what I mean? I just got to keep finishing fights, keep ending guys, you know, in their career. So, yeah. Adesanya is facing Perea. That's going to be going down in Madison Square Garden for the belt, man. Perea's got the best of him. But in kickboxing, though, how do you see one playing out inside the octagon? Man, Izzy, Izzy's really good, you know, and I can see him crazy enough to even try to attempt a takedown, you know what I mean? I could expect that from Izzy because he's crazy, you know what I mean? And he's an entertainer, so I could see him doing something like that, but uh, I think he gets it out. I think he I think he squeaks by. And then we got Sean Strickland fighting Jared, the Killer Gorilla Cannoneer man. That's entertainment. That, that's, a, that's a really good fight. Um, both of those guys are tough. They're cool. Uh, Strickland's a little weird. Uh, you know how it is. Uh, but yeah, it's going to be a good fight. Define weird. Peculiar. There you go. Peculiar. Choosing his words wisely. Can we get a final message for the No Hype fans out there worldwide? No Hype. Stay tuned. October 29th, we're getting another dub. Let's go. He's the pro. I'm the Schmo Las Vegas. ADCC. Catch that grappling. We're out. Let's go. My dog.